the buzzword a thon day one. Um, it's like six o'clock. I am just getting up to get ready to go to work. I am very tired. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've had to be up this early for work. Um, so um, I have. <sighs> I have the um, audiobook for Lie to Me by J.T. Ellison, which is um, the domestic thriller. If you haven't seen my TV, I'll link that down below. But I have the audiobook for that, so I think I might um, start the audiobook for that on my way to work. I have like a 12 minute walk, so um, I think I might start that. And then I'm going to bring, physically, I'm going to bring Seven Ways We Lie by Riley Redgate, um, since it'll be like a thriller and a contemporary, um, um I don't even think I'm going to get very much reading done at all today, um, usually my days are pretty busy, but... I'm gonna bring it with me, we'll see, um, maybe we'll get a little bit of reading done, like, on my breaks and during my lunch, um, but I have to get dressed and get ready to go to work, but I just wanted to pop in and say good morning, happy Buzzwordathon day one, um, and I will check in with you guys a little bit later, bye! <laughs> guys so it is like 4 30 or so i've been home for a little bit um but i wanted to pop in and let you guys know that i did read chapter one of seven ways we live by riley redgate which was like 16 pages um on my lunch and like during my breaks it's still too early to tell if i'm gonna like it or not um not much happened in the first chapter so i don't really know if it's gonna be something that i enjoy i'm gonna definitely continue reading it um, and we'll see where the story goes. This is going to be my physical book that I read for the next couple of days. And then um, I did walk home today because I only have like a 12, 15 minute walk um, from my job. But this morning I was going to walk there, but I was running late. So I decided to just Uber so I could stop for coffee. Um, but I did walk home because it was really nice. And on my... And on my commute home, I listened to 28 Pages in Lie to Me by J.T. Ellison, which is a domestic thriller, definite Gone Girl vibes. Um, and I feel like this is going to be a very quick, fast-paced read because I'm already 30 pages in or so, and I was only listening to it for like 15 minutes. Um, but I think that this is probably going to be the book that I read um, as an audiobook because the audiobook is very fast-paced, and I was definitely intrigued um, from the very beginning and it's a full cast audiobook which is makes it even better um, but I'm really excited to dive into this and basically this if you don't know is a domestic thriller uh, about a couple who the wife Sutton goes missing and the husband and the husband Ethan um, is trying to find her and he slowly becomes accused of maybe killing her or 
her her being him being at fault for her disappearing so it definitely has gone girl vibes um but i definitely think it's going to be a quick fast-paced read so these are my priority for the next couple days i'm going to go ahead and continue to read this physically um and then listen to this as an audiobook i am pretty tired i have to be at work at six tomorrow um but i get off at 2 30 so that's really nice and then wednesday and thursday i go in at six um so it's gonna be a long week but i have friday off so that'll be nice uh which is my day to just plan i plan on reading like all day friday um but i think i might take a quick little power nap kind of just refresh get some energy before i go ahead and dive into a little bit more of seven ways we lie i have the house all to myself tonight so i'm definitely just going to plan on getting as much reading done as possible um if you are participating in buzzwordathon what are you reading i hope you guys are having a great day happy reading happy buzzwordathon day one and i will check in with you guys a little bit later Bye. It's like 10 45 i'm gonna beat myself up in the morning because i have to be at work at like 5 45 it's gonna be rough but i just wanted to pop in with kind of a wrap up for day one of buzzword of thumb round two so i ended up reading uh, 50 pages in seven ways we lie by riley redgate um basically it follows seven main characters which each one of the characters is a seven deadly sin um, it's an interesting concept. I don't know how I feel about it yet, yet. I still think it's a little early to determine if I'm liking it or not. And, and then I'm up to page 38 in Lie to Me by J.T. Ellison. Which, um, and this is a pretty fast-paced read. I definitely think I can go ahead and get a lot of this done tomorrow. This is my audiobook. So between these two, I have read a total of 88 pages. So for day one of Buzzword Athon round two, which is definitely more than I was planning on reading, I thought maybe I was going to get like 20 pages read. So 88 pages for day one is pretty good progress. Hey, everyone had a great day. Um, happy reading and I will see you guys in the morning. Good night.